All right, good morning, Monday morning. It's a new week. It's a bit cloudier today than it's been. Um, Mr. Macro Man is here to dig out a pool for our buffaloes. So I'm gonna go and show you. It's still very boggy down here in the, uh, in the paddy. Oh, hang on. I have just brought him out some water and uh, see how he's getting on. Hello, I can't in cow, I can't in cow, Mr. Macro. Hmm. 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 Yeah. Can't in cow. Oh, they're dumb, dumb scally. Yeah. Oh, I love you, me. Huh? Love you, me. There we go. It goes pretty quick. Time for a break. And the neighbours to come and share their opinions of things. And right, some of you eagle-eyed viewers might have noticed I had a bit of a makeshift lamp here in the last video. Um, Unfortunately, I'd left my desk lamp at the house and uh, forgotten it. And uh, I need, it's too dark in this corner otherwise. I, I'm, I like a desk lamp over my keyboard and whatever over my desk. So um, anyway, I went and fetched it the other day and uh, I finally mounted it on the wall, which is something I was going to do. It's got a screw mount uh, yeah, on the yellow thing there, but um, it's just, it's not high enough. So uh, now it's uh, very flexible like that and I've just put this extra bit of paper around it just to say that it glares a bit because the lamp the actual bulb is uh, is a bit too long so it sticks out rather bright but uh, yeah I'm very pleased about that so now I can uh, can move it out of the way of course and uh, have it how I want it so I can get to work gonna do a um, a sloping side here so they can walk down and not straight deep sides like the other three sides. Okay, the pool's looking good. Um, not finished yet, but uh, I'm going to prepare so that I can uh, just run a hose off to it and we can just run it all day with the pump from the pool. But uh, yeah, a little bit of plumbing for you plumbing fans out there. Um, I'm going to take some bits from here where the dogs have chewed it because I need to redo all that again but um, I've got a perfect part there that I need so I'm going to cut that off and I'm going to go and do a, a bit of magic over there. Right, there was a tap there, I've just cut it off here and I'm going to use this piece instead with the valve so it doesn't need to go up the height from the tap. Okay, in between times, I've just fixed the one that was leaking all over the shop. And uh, it looks like the tractor had driven up here. You can see the tractor tire. I think he'd done the three point turn, but he'd gone over the pipe because because the pipe isn't very visible when you've got long grass like this. Anyway, that should do the trick. And go back to the other one now. All right, before I connect up that, here there's a, uh, a tree that came down, don't care. So uh, it's now leaning on this mango tree and not doing it any favour. So I'm going to saw off the branches there and try and uh, remove that so it doesn't land on any pipes and damage them. Right, I've done the water plumbing bits. Open both the pumps, one up from the well and one out from the 
pool, which is the one that's pumped into the other pool now. Well, hopefully we'll be able to go and check it. It's only coming out from that hose, so it's going to take a while, but it's, um, it's all good. And uh, we'll get there slowly. I might even get the other pump working. There's another well there that would pump it easier and quicker. So, but that's another job that needs doing that. Wasn't pumping very well. Last time we were here and I didn't get around to fixing it. Okay, so uh, yeah, like I say, not the biggest flow of water, but just leave it on pumping and uh, it'll soon do the job. Slowly, slowly. It's only been filling a couple of hours, so uh, it's doing the job. Okay, look, only a little bit of water, but they're very happy already. Lounging in the water, wallowing. Happy, happy. Are you happy? Yeah, she's happy when she sees a buffalo in the water. I quickly show you the uh, we're making bailing the straw at um nah don't go today. So Okay, today we uh, are going to have some visitors, so I'm not going to film them. Uh, I haven't asked them if they want to be in the video, but um, my friend Greg and his wife have just arrived. They live in Sukhothai, so uh, they're on a bit of a tour around uh, Isan at the moment. So I'm going to go out and say hello to them. All right, we just put around to Jao's friend's farm to cut grass, or rather rice, um, for the buffaloes and. Uh, We've got one of these here, Fat Giaos, these uh, green, I don't know what they call them, winter melons, they call them winter melons. And uh, I noticed them growing here, they are absolutely massive. There's a couple on the roof here, just to give you an idea, that's my hand. <laughs> so that's them. But they're hanging here as well, I'm just surprised that they actually, that they can hang that, that when they're that heavy right that they don't fall down anyway we've been given one so uh, i like that in a soup winter melon soup it's very good anyway we're gonna get uh, back to the farm in a minute just to say just cutting the um, a bit of fresh rice grass for uh, for the buffaloes by the way i had a very nice uh, visit from greg and payom this morning um i didn't show you them because i obviously i hadn't asked them in advance um, however, we're going to meet them tomorrow, uh, all things being equal, and we're going to go for breakfast at Nong Pajak. Um, and uh, Greg was uh, okay for, to be filmed in my video, so uh, I may well show you, uh, show you them then when we meet up, and show you our adventures for breakfast um, tomorrow. But it was very nice to meet them today. And also a big thanks to Greg for this beautiful hat. Um, it's really very nice indeed. It's an Australian hat and uh, just the business for um, hot sunny Thailand. So uh, yeah, thanks very much. I really, really do like it. Let's do another job. <laughs> yeah, the buffaloes are really enjoying their pool now. So it was well worth it. Happy as Larry. Good morning, uh, Thursday. Today we are going to go out and uh, eat breakfast with our friends, um, which meant a bit of an early start, but um, when I say early start, it's roughly the same sort of time as normal, but um, we just have to get a bit of a move on. <laughs> so, uh, gonna get dressed um, and uh, we will make a 
years ago. Taz out with the buffalo. She's just taking them back in. She's been out with them for an hour or more. Um, I've just fed the dogs and the cats. And um, yeah, it's a lovely day. So let's get on. We made it into town a bit later than planned. Traffic, etc. It's a bit slow, but uh, we're here now, so it's walking down to uh, to meet them. Oh, <laughs> they say me, but I wouldn't get in there. Hello, hello. So they're going to try the famous Kai Gata we've ordered, so uh, it's own time for that. Alright, the Kai Gata has arrived. Charles got soup. Okay, we've um, left Greg. He's off to Long Kai. We've come down to uh, Montana to the fruit market, but first we're going to Mr. DIY here. Yeah, I love Mr. DIY. They sell absolutely everything. And prices are very good as well. Bag full of, or a basket full of goodies. Right, let's see what else I want. Right, just like that, a whole bag full of stuff. And a, a stick. I bought this um, shower squeezy from Sweden, they're very good, we've got one in the house, at, uh, we brought one for the farm, but we needed a, a handle for it, but 14 baht in Mr. DIY, can't complain. Alright, quick stop in the, to the market to get some, um, hopefully to get some corn husks for the buffaloes, and then we're going to go and look at mopeds again. We can come to have a look at the Honda place this time because Joe wants to compare with Nat, as I said earlier. So we'll have a little look, see what's what. So we've got some prices now to compare with them. Um, Nat, which we will be going back to tomorrow. The girl, I think she's back tomorrow, and uh, we will see whether we end up going there or going to Nat to buy. But um, we're gonna get some food now and then we're gonna go back home. I'm tired now. This is one of my purchases from uh, Mr. DIY, a new. A new cover for the washing machine. There was one on there, but it, uh, I think it got destroyed during the, the wet and windy season. So uh, it's good to have a cover on it because it's in the sun, uh, as you can see, half of it is at the minute, but quite a lot of, of it gets in the sun earlier on in the day. So I bought that. They're very good and they uh, about 80 baht. And I bought a new, uh, for under this sink, which is all leaking, I bought a new U-Bend, uh, what do you want to call it? So, uh, I'm going to fix that sink. And, uh, yeah, I bought a load of just small stuff, but things for the house, you know, that it's very good there, Mr. DIY. Anyway, I am going to call it a day on this video now. I, uh, I'm going to try and get it edited and out tonight. It's Thursday. Um, the Thursday, the what? I don't know. 17th, I think, of November. So, um, thanks a lot for watching. Please give the video a thumbs up. Um, share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. And, uh, yeah, I'll catch you all on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.